Is this the start of a new vlog? Who knows? But it's Friday. Is it Friday? It's Friday. Wow. Yesterday was like semi a day off for me, even though I had a meeting. So I did end up going into town um, and I did some work at home. But for the most part, I was able to be in my pajamas for most of the day and just work from home, which was great. It is freezing. It is so cold. It says it's 53 degrees outside, but I do not believe that to be true. Like it feels like it's in the 40s slash 30s, but who am I to judge? Who am I to say? I'm going to the 7.30 sculpt class and then the 9 a.m. yoga class and then I teach the 10.30. So, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a fun morning. I, oh, it was a full moon last night and I slept so freaking well. It was such a good night's sleep and I like probably 10 hours at least. Wow, it was really, really good. Super stoked on that. Uh, but let's see. Yesterday, I just, I have not like really worked out in two days and I'm, I'm just like feeling so freaking antsy. I could have worked out yesterday, but I just didn't feel like it. And also I knew that I needed to give my legs a break just cause they've been like really sore for about a week now. And I needed to just let them live a little bit. <laughs> so I'm glad I took the, day, the time off, but I definitely feel just like I feel gross. So I need to just go in and take a couple classes, feel good about it. And then this, this is just going to be a good day. It's just going to be a good day after that. So I do have an appointment today. This is going to sound really weird, but I have an appointment today um, at Lulu because I am treating somebody to an outfit and uh, the Lulu gals are going to help us with that. So that's gonna be fun. So I'm meeting up with my friend around 12.30. I think so anyway, I haven't heard from her, but um, <laughs> I, think, I think our date is at 12.30 today. And so that will be kind of the bookend of my whole entire morning. And then I'll have the rest of the day off. I don't have, oh, I do teach the boot camp class tomorrow. So I'll have to figure something out for that as far as playlist and stuff. So I'll have to plan that. But yeah, and I'm going to try to take the ride class after that. So it's going to be, the next couple days is going to be kind of full with work and stuff and classes and all of that. But it'll be fun. Mm. Good matcha this morning, stuff. Great job. Slay. the best part of the day. Thank you for agreeing. We're going to boot camp. Nick, this is your first boot camp class in yeah. quite some time. It's been like three weeks. Three weeks. I haven't done any hot anything for like three weeks. No, because he was injured. I was injured, but that was only for like a week and a half. And then like... Okay, injured and then excuses.
saying. Okay. <laughs> You'll never believe this. We came back from lunch. I think I'm safe, yeah. Nick? Uh, looks good. I'm safe. And we're driving home. Lo and behold, it's, oh. it's Girl Scout season. <laughs> Nick, what did we get? Paul? Oh, uh, uh, it was within their, okay, so we got it within their first two hours of sales. Peanut butter patties, thin mints. Yeah. The, you know, not made in heaven. It's January. They come out in February normally. Like, uh, they're doing it so early this good. year. Every year it's earlier. It's just like Christmas decorations. Every year it gets, gets earlier, earlier and earlier because they can sell you on it. You know what's not getting earlier? Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> Notice that? <laughs> but, but for some reason, Valentine's Day. Yeah, Valentine's Day, people are all about it right now. Yeah, like at Christmas, they're like, oh, Christmas is over, it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> I think Valentine's Day is in like three weeks. So oh my gosh. We have Thin Mints, babe. What are the other ones called again? Peanut butter... Patties versus Patties. sandwiches. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited because I was just sad how we didn't have any like candy or anything. headed to the range right now. I'm driving down my driveway. <laughs> I have my mom's homemade English muffin mm, with nutso butter on top. I had a really nice workout this morning. I ended up not feeling like doing any crazy strength training today. I didn't feel like doing getting on the bike either just because my legs are sore today. Very sore today. So I did a little yoga flow with some wrist and ankle weights which i absolutely loved it was basically yoga sculpt with without dumbbells it was it was really really fun i really enjoyed it we were gonna go to north fork today but i don't think that's gonna happen we were debating whether we wanted to go to the cabin or work on getting our hot tub installed because if you don't know we've had a hot tub for three years that we have not had the money or the energy time to install at our house so we've had a hot tub that's been just sitting there and it's wrapping for three years. A little about us is the energy that we have is put into our studios and not our house. <laughs> That's the tweet. All right, range day complete. It was a lot of fun. 
I had a blast. I have some time to burn, almost two hours to kill before <laughs> this meeting. So I'm um, basically the meeting, I'm gonna be teaching a 60 minute class, which I do not feel like doing, but I think it's necessary. Um, so I'm gonna teach the class and then we'll have a discussion afterwards. So I think before that though, uh, I think I'm gonna go on a walk. over I honestly don't know how I'm feeling about it <laughs> I really don't I just I already have a really hard time like getting clear on exactly what I want and then therefore asking for what I want I just feel like that meeting I don't know it left me really self-conscious I don't know not feeling good. I don't know. I just don't feel good. I think it was just because I was basically trying to just make clear exactly like how I wanted to structure everything and just the feedback that I've received and also like making sure we're all on the same page with everything. And I don't think I came across as like demanding or whatever, but I feel like there was just no one was really stoked about what I had to say. <laughs> it's not any fault of theirs. I think it's maybe how I was communicating. I don't know, the whole time I'm like, do you guys hate me? Anyway, I left feeling not as great as I thought that I would about it, but hopefully, hopefully at the very least, I got everybody on the same page and we all kind of know the basic structure of things. I'm just feeling very discouraged right now, but it's okay. Oh the line is even long. Alright, see you again? Yeah. This is a very hungry family. <laughs> You're looking at when hunger strikes. We are in Kettleman City at the iconic, the legendary in Malberger. And we got some good shit. And I'm really excited. <laughs> Bailey's.
are you, what are we doing right now? I'm trying to order a take and bake pizza, but there's a confirmed password. You can't paste, and so now I'm in a tight spot. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a Papa Murphy's here. Take and, and bake. Take and bake. If any of you remember you Papa know. Murphy's. If you know, you know. There used to be one in a Tascadere. Oh, Tascadere, yes. Yeah, and it was good. And my buddy worked there, and I would get good pizza. Yeah, and so Oakhurst. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> um, wow, but sorry. we sometimes get here. It's been a really long time since we've done this, by yeah, the way. Because there's another pizza place actually in North Fork Town that's really good too. What's that place called? Yeah. So that's our dinner. <laughs> I'll tell you.